people, Bernard Riley back up in here with some more of this black media mayhem. What is going on? What we're seeing right now, what we're seeing right now is the early stages of what Kanye West was actually trying to protect his daughter, Northwest, from. Because they are at the early stages, the early stages of officially turning her into a Kardashian. An image was put out there by Kim Kardashian of Northwest holding up a sign at one of the events that Kim Kardashian was at, one of her promotional events where she's advertising or promoting one of her products, something that she basically just puts her name on and then it sells more, apparently. She's taken Northwest on those events and paparazzi all in Northwest's face and Northwest uh, held up a sign, wrote on, a, wrote on a sign or a piece of paper, stop, and held it up. And held up the sign so the paparazzi could see it as she was saying, stop taking pictures of me. But Kim Kardashian apparently thinks that this is all this wonderful thing. She's saying, as a mom, I'm so grateful that my daughter loves coming with me on my work trips. And I'm able to bring her and create these memories together along with my mom. For anyone who knows North knows how funny she finds the last slide. North, I guess, had it with the people taking pictures of her. So she wrote on her invite, stop, and held it up and wanted them to just focus on the show. There was also another video of Northwest leaving an event and kind of lashing out at the media and the paparazzi. Why do you have to wait for us all the time? <laughs> because you're so famous, we love you, nerd. Go all the way back to when Kanye West, as a father, was saying he didn't want his daughter on TikTok. He didn't, he didn't want her being in the limelight he didn't want her living that life he's he's basically made the argument that he took the slings and the arrows and put himself out there and dealt with the media and everybody being in his business and witnessing and or causing his mental breakdowns he basically wanted to protect his daughters from that he's successful he's a billionaire his kids don't have to go through that but kim kardashian is just thrusting her out there into the limelight the limelight that kanye west as a father wanted to protect his daughter from but the mom is saying, no, we need more of it. She's looking at this from this perspective because nothing is on accident with them. Everything is calculated. Everything is deliberate. So more than likely what's happening here is they're doing the early stages of trying to build her up, trying to make her a Kardashian. Yes, I understand she's a Kardashian biologically, but they're trying to make her a Kardashian as part of the brand. They're looking at it like right now, she's almost 10 years old. I predict that in six years, when she's 16 and she starts to develop and fill out a little bit, it's going to be probably some salacious photos and all kind of stuff out there with with, with a Northwest to basically to try to hand over the keeping up with the Kardashian brand image and show and all of that onto the kids. Because in six years, the Kardashians, even though they're attractive, they're going to be all closing in on 50. You know, they're not going to be able to hide their age at that point. So they're going to be basically trying to hand it over to the kids. But Kanye is, was basically legitimately saying, no, I don't want that for my kids. But they're saying whatever. They're, she's she's a part of this. <laughs> she's a part of this machine, whether you like it or not. And you're just her father. So it's not like you really have any actual say here. <laughs> know, know your place, know your role, fall in line. <laughs> like that's that's basically her response to Kanye West trying to protect his daughter from all the stuff that drove him crazy and made him rich. Which he has a good argument, we're already rich, we don't have to put all this on her. So as a father, I understand Kanye West's problem right there. I understand his dilemma through all his craziness and rants and rambles and all over the place ramblings and everything. I do understand where he's coming from. He wants to keep his kids out of all the Kardashian nonsense, but then you shouldn't have put kids in a Kardashian, but some would argue being connected to the Kardashian is part of what helped him become a billionaire. So he's in a pickle. He's in a rock and a hard place. He's in a tough spot. And he has no power in the situation because she has the custody, as most women do, which means they have full creative control and influence over the kids. And if the kid turns out crazy, the dad, who was only around 10% of the time by law, per the court order, is going to get 100% of the blame if the kid doesn't turn out right. We know how that goes. But yeah. In Kanye West's song, Violent Crimes, where he was talking about being a father and he was talking about protecting his daughter from other men, he said in that song, I pray you don't get it all at once. Curves under your dress. I know it's pervs all on the net, all in the comments. I want to vomit. That's your baby. You love her to death. 
He said that in that song when he was talking about protecting her from men who would prey on her when she becomes of age. But the fact of the matter is the people that he truly has to protect her from, the ones that he are truly in a fight to protect her from as she comes of age, are the ones who are raising her. But that's my take on this Black Media Mayhem. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Rather, I got it right, got it wrong. Like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. You know what it is. And we out of here. Peace. We gone.